Today's scripture reading begins in verse 51 of 1 Corinthians chapter 15. Behold, I am telling you a mystery. We will not all sleep, but we will all be changed in a moment, in the twinkling of an eye at the last trumpet. For the trumpet will sound, and the dead will be raised, imperishable, and we will be changed. For this perishable must put on the imperishable, and this mortal must put on immortality. But when this perishable puts on the imperishable, and this mortal puts on immortality, then will come about the saying that is written, Death has been swallowed up in victory. Where, O death, is your victory? Where, O death, is your sting? The sting of death is sin, and the power of sin is the law. But thanks be to God, who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, my beloved brothers and sisters, be firm, immovable, always excelling in the work of the Lord, knowing that your labor is not in vain in the Lord. We would all agree Life can be difficult. Pressures of daily living can feel overwhelming. Relationships can disappoint us. And at times, our expectations go unmet. So it's good for those of us who are believers to remember an important truth that can sustain us. This life is not all there is. The best is yet to come. Having the promise of the resurrection gives us the motivation we need to be firm, immovable, always excelling in the work of the Lord, as we read in 1 Corinthians chapter 15. We know that our efforts are never in vain, and our Heavenly Father has provided everything we need to succeed. God's Word reveals His purpose for all believers, and as we apply it, transforms our character, thoughts, and behaviors to align with His desires. The Holy Spirit providentially guides us into God's will and empowers our obedience. Spiritual gifts are given by the Holy Spirit and enable us to serve the Lord in the way He's planned. And prayer allows us to communicate with God at any time to receive guidance and grace to help with every need. These remarkable divine provisions, together with the promise of resurrection and the glories of heaven, Give us good reason to persevere and never lose heart.